Hey guys, this is Sean Rolu. How's everybody doing today? On the last episode, we actually came across in Mount Moon, battled against some of the Team Rocket, and also got me a new member of my team, Cliff Fairy. So I reached her up to level 16 along with my new, newly evolved form of Neorino. And also, we met up with a, a gang called Team Rocket, as usual. So now, we're going to continue this on. And Nova's having her uh, drink of water in case if you guys are hearing click, 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 click. So, I've been actually uh, training up my uh, Pokemon just a little bit. So far, I'm not really... <laughs> I don't really remember if it's only my badge that needs to be on level 20 or level 30 in order to, like, um, get my Pokemon to level 20. Because I'm afraid if I go any further, two of my Pokemon will probably, uh, will not obey me. So I just gotta be careful by that. I had that exactly same thing happen to me when I was, uh, training up my Pokemon to up a level, of uh, over 20 without the badge. I don't remember which game it was. I think it was probably game uh, Pokemon X version. And the last time I accidentally uh, went up a, a few more levels, like almost over 20, and uh, apparently my Pokemon uh, would not obey me. The only one who would actually obey me is my starter Pokemon. So, in case if you guys are wondering, um, just be very careful that if you have, like, the same thing happen, try not to push your Pokemon to go up a 20 or over 20, okay? I had that happen to me a lot, and I had to be very careful by that. But, other than that, um, Charmeleon is actually doing really well. I haven't used him for a while, and, uh, look what we have here. A Moonstone! And I get encountered. <laughs> okay. So, I, uh, I didn't play the game, uh, the other day and yesterday because I've been kind of busy and, excuse you, I've been kind of busy and also very tired, so, uh, also my leg was actually a bit sore. I think I might have pushed myself a little bit too far, uh, the other day by helping my father, uh, doing a lot of wood, so... So that's what I've been doing uh, all day yesterday, uh, the other day, I meant to say. And um, it really sucks because uh, as much as I really do want to do my drawings or uh, do the recording with you guys, but after work, I was very exhausted. So in my case, I didn't really care. So I apologize for that. So while we're walking in Mount Moon, there's something I want to tell you about that. There's a whole freaking field of freaking Zubat. And they're fucking annoying. Like, can you not tell it's a mountain of Zubat? Yeah. So far, that sucks. So, Nova? Did you seriously put some of your food up in the Ferris wheel again? Apparently, she did. <laughs> I don't know what is it with my hamster. She has, like, a thing about, like, uh, taking food and her bedding sets, uh, up on her Ferris wheel, as I call it. It's actually a big hamster wheel, but it's huge, and from what angle, it looks like a freaking Ferris wheel. So, it's, um, it's kind of weird how I look at it, you know? I mean, it looks like a Ferris wheel. Didn't I just click B, I, even though I just, like, freaking... Okay, never mind. Apparently, I wasn't paying attention to, um, uh, the game. I was paying attention to my hamster, which is so weird. Like, this is the first time I actually have a hamster, uh, like, forever, because my, uh, parents thinking, oh, I don't have the capability of not taking care of a hamster, which, um, which I'm actually learning how to do that, actually, because so far, I really do love my little Nova. My, uh... My mom, my dad, my sister, and my brother-in-law decided to, like, give the hamster to me on my birthday. And, um, I was very looking forward to that because, as I told you guys before, I didn't even know it was a surprise uh, that I was just, like, you know, sitting downstairs watching the dog and keep, uh, watching my shows and keep an eye on the dog. And 
for the moment later, that's when uh, they actually surprised me with a hamster cage on my bed. <laughs> so, at first I was like, uh, what the fuck is this? Uh, it's a freaking hamster cage. So, yeah, I was... Uh, fucking buttons! Excuse you! So, yeah, I was actually looking forward to that, so... I am happy that I got myself a hamster. So far, she seemed to be doing okay. I'm just like, watching her, and she has like one of her, um, uh, one of the, uh, one of her big food that looks like a freaking hamburger that is rolling right behind her while she's running. No, but seriously, your freaking hamster wheel's not supposed to be a freaking bedding. <laughs> oh my god. Like I said, I love my hamster. She's just weird. I mean, there's nothing wrong with weird animals, is there? Okay, let's use a... I think he might have soundproof. It's a freaking bat, so it could make sense. So, let's see. Oh, nope. Does Zubat even have the ability in order to have soundproof? I don't know. The last time I used thing on uh, Voltorb, it has soundproof, so that's actually sucked. You know, that's the thing I don't understand. Voltorb is supposed to be looking like a ball, uh, with explosion ball. Is it possible that maybe that um, Voltorb is just, like, um, having no ears? I don't know. It just came occur to me. I mean, is Voltorb supposed to not have hearing and not be able to hear anybody? I don't know. I mean, it's a distinct possibility. You know, sometimes I look at Pokemon that has no ears and thinking, Oh, well, they can't hear you. Well, technically they can. Yeah! Fucking Zubat! Get me out of here. Yes! Ah! Okay. So I hope you guys have a nice uh, Tuesday. I heard on the um, the new uh, Pokemon... Hold on, before I continue this. On! Son of a bitch! So much easier when you're playing 3DS games. Okay. Okay, so as I was saying before, so they were actually uh, talking about the new Pokemon update of Pokemon Crown of Tetra. I am so looking forward to it. Like, I'm not kidding. I'm still looking forward to it. I've been looking forward to it all month. And I was like thinking, well, when is it coming? When I looked up on Google and it says it won't be coming out until November, I'm like, oh, come on. But no, it decided to come out in October 22nd. Yes, I am looking forward to that. Oh my god, you have no idea how much I'm looking forward to that. Uh, that's a really weird looking standing up of the freaking Nidorino. I mean, I've seen it before when it was on Pokemon Let's Go Eevee, but that's just really weird. Oh, well, can't deny on that one. So, anyways, um... So, yeah, I was really looking forward to it. I am still looking forward to it. Not to mention that Pokemon Snap won't be coming in until, like, uh... Somewhere around December. I don't remember which one it is, and... Really? I'm immune to freaking poison. Really? Well then. That was oddly strange. Okay, Clefairy. I have a feeling you have soundproof, so I'm gonna use a uh, pound. Ugh, critical. Can I get a critical? No. Oh well. You're dead anyway. Oh well. 
That was uh, not very challenging, but okay. No being greedy, eh? You suck. Unfortunately, we can't take both fossils. We can only take one, which is sucks. So, uh, before I click any of them, if you click one fossil and you cannot get the other one for a long, long, long time in order to complete your Pokedex, it's always a good idea to either have another Fire Red or uh, Leaf Green with you. And then you'll be able to, like, uh, trade the Pokemon that you don't even have. And then, uh, you can try to complete the Pokedex there. Um, you can always, like, have another game with you or have a friend who has a game and, uh, be able to trade. So, the first off is the Helix Fossil. It contains with, uh, Omanyte. Not a very good Pokemon in my- well, actually, they're all really good Pokemon. But it's not really my favorite Pokemon in the world. However... I do like this one, Dome Fossil. It contains with freaking um, uh, Kabuto. So Kabuto is mo most likely my favorite. However, we won't be able to like um, restore fossils for a very long time. So might as well keep it with you. What do you have to say? Yep, so in other words, we had to go to Cinnabar Island in order to, like, uh, uh, in order to, you know, like, uh, restore the fossils. So that pretty much sucks. So, um, do I have any, uh, uh, no, that, that doesn't, wait, what, what, what does it say? Oh, yeah, actually, yeah, I looked up, um, uh, confusion. So, don't have any, uh, freaking antidote because I used the last bit of it. So, bear with me, Charmeleon. Bear with me. I know you can do it, baby boy. I know you can do it. You're strong. You're strong. Hi. And that is... Oh, of course! Oh, of course! Why am I not surprised? Oh my goodness. And now we are out of Mount Moo into Route 4. At first when I played this game, I thought they were actually trainers. No, they're move tutors. This one contains um, Mega Kick. And uh, all three of my Pokemon can learn it. Let's see here. Oh, actually, Reno can't use it? He knows how to use double kick, so... Okay. Um... Hmm. Uh, I'm gonna go with, um, Clefairy. I think she can do much better than that. Okay, let's see here. I'm gonna get rid of Growl. Yep, Growl is gone. And this guy actually contains, um, a uh, Mega Punch. So in other words, I can have a uh, Charmeleon learn it. Okay, um, I'm gonna get rid of Growl as well. So now, uh, both of my both of my Pokemon actually can learn how to use Mega Kick and Growl, except for uh, some reason of um, Nidorino, which is oddly enough. And there's no items here. Great. Also, if you can look out, uh, watch over of uh, these uh, patch of uh, green grass, like that one here. Even though I don't like to use berries very often, but they can be rather useful. Okay, so we got TMO5 Roar, which is okay, I guess. Okay, so we can't go up here because there was a girl up there and I want to battle, but fortunately you cannot. 
Okay. Oh, that's hot. I'm actually on my heating pad, so... I really do love my heating pad, but this heating pad heats up very quickly. And here we are! Cerulean City! Ah, it's always good to be here in the Cerulean City. The only problem is, my Pokémon's not very strong enough yet, so I suggest I'm going to keep on training before getting to the gym. But, uh, before we do that, I want to look around the city. I want to look around the city to see if there's any, uh, things I can actually get. So, in other words, I'm going to talk to a lot of people. Because it's always a good idea to talk to a lot of people in order to, like, uh, see what you need to do or what items you're going to get or what Pokemon you're going to trade. It's always a good idea to actually learn these things. So, it's a not a really bad idea to talk to them. Oh, uh, let's see, your uh, traded Pokemon. So, in other words, there is a tradable thing. Hello there. Do you happen to have Polyworld? Would you would you agree to trade with, uh, for my Shinx? Or uh, Jinx? Shinx, really? Um, so... The only problem is, I do want to trade with this guy in order to get Jinx. However... In order to get Poliwhirl, you had to find Poliwag, which I think you can only get Poliwag by fishing. I do believe. I could be wrong on that, but I'll have to look it up. Um, however, I won't be able to find Poliwag to uh, to evolve um, to evolve it into Poliwhirl in a later time. So that's a uh, pretty sad and all. Um, is there any items here? No. Aha! I knew there was going to be an item here somewhere. I knew there was going to be an item. I was like thinking there has to be an item here somewhere, right? But other hands, uh, that's always a good thing. Uh, tell me, have you been sure? Okay, I'm gonna have to look that thing up. Let's see, that's on the key item, right? Hmm. You know, I never actually uh, knew about that one. Let's see here. That's very... And uh, I don't really particularly worry about it, because um, even though there are items that is actually very useful to use, however... I don't really actually use them very often, so that pretty much sucks about that. So, you either have, like, uh, two choices that you can actually do. Either one, you can go battle... Okay. Um, you can either go battle the gym leader, or you can actually uh, go up to uh, the Nugget Bridge. Okay. Okay. <laughs> He's not even looking at me. So, in other words, I'm going to be training up a little bit, so in order to, like, uh, get my Pokemon a little stronger. So, in other words, um, I either have two choices, like I said, but I'm actually gonna wait until I actually train up my Pokemon a little while longer. So in the meantime, guys, please make a like down below and also subscribe, and if you want to comment to me, please feel free. Hope you guys have a wonderful, beautiful day.